The other problem is that ever since Indian movies stopped coming and playing. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I agree with you. I mean, like content like across, I mean, if you share their content, like your content can go out there. Like, I mean, there could be a deal. Like, I mean, there needs to be more. But anyways, like, I mean, that's a much like deeper topic. And I think we can discuss that for like hours at length. Um, another pressing issue that I kind of feel and like why and I wanted to discuss with you was that there doesn't seem to be that much camaraderie in the industry because um, it almost seems like that every director, producer, pub, like production house is kind of like in their own world and feel like they're an industry in themselves because when the films are kind of coming out, every there are six movies releasing on Eid weekend. Absolutely. So we are having a lot of those teething problems. You have to understand that till about 2005, we had a proper industry. If films, uh, you know, the f movies were coming out of the studios, uh, there was a system in place. Even the most unsuccessful film at the box office would eventually make its money back. There was an understanding between the distributors, the exhibitors, and the producers, the three main branches of the industry. Mm. But now, that we started the whole uh, you know, cinema thing again, there is no understanding. Um, exhibitors and distributors and producers are at loggerheads uh, with each other when they need to be united. Uh, they need to understand that it has to be a win-win situation for all. I mean, recently we saw on Eid where a lot of producers took certain cinema owners to court because they felt that uh, Doctor Strange did not, you know, was not supposed to be released. I mean, on Eid. like it's yeah, like but make better content and don't release everything at the same time. Well, you know that. The, uh, uh, I mean, so I'm not taking any sides. I'm saying that was a big problem as to uh, you, you know, when you've got a big Hollywood film coming, or in the in the previous times there was a big Indian film coming, and there's Pakistani movies. Uh, create a fair uh, level uh, playing space to that. Uh, your Pakistani films do well. So there's that problem. Then the other uh, uh, big issue is, um, you know, cin uh, producers need to realize they can't release four or five films. So they're responsible for their own issues. Yeah. So you can't blame that on the exhibitor. No, you can't. If you're releasing four films on Eid, then so you're dividing that very limited business into four. Just release two. And uh, that is where the discipline has to come in with the producers. So after that, when the producers cry that this, uh, uh, exhibitors are not giving us the right, uh, you know, level uh, space or are not giving us the right uh, time slots, they're only to blame themselves. Because they should yeah. have just realized whichever two films say, okay, now we're going to release on Eid, those are the two films that should come, the rest should come later. I mean, I felt the same way about Kamli. That was like, it didn't come out in, in, right. on any Eid weekend, nothing. It just came out, literally out of the blue. Right. And I mean, they had to extend its show times and they of had to course. extend because... Again, it was A, the product was really good. It was a very interesting and very different film that yeah. like like was coming out of Pakistan. And it also appealed to people. Right. Uh, visually, it was nice. And there wasn't any other really Pakistani movie that was coming out or any big release was around right. there. Right. So they were like, okay, let's give it a shot. Yeah, you see, that's the thing. You have big blockbuster films with the big stars and then you have out-of-the-box films. Yeah. What we need to make are films that are produced in the two to three crore, three and a half crore range that then do well enough to recover their costs in Pakistan and then through digital rights and through satellite rights and through some international play, make their money back. That's a very, that's a very smart way of looking at it. I really do hope that like, kind of like this kind of vision, I think more producers mm. and like, I mean, I, I think that's what we need to kind of create in the industry, right? Yes, like absolutely. in order to build it again, like, right. I mean, by, like bygones be bygones, there was an industry, it's not there anymore. Yeah. We're not sitting in that age anymore. So I, I don't believe in looking back, like looking back is like, Learn from your mistakes. What's ahead? Like, how are we kind of taking this forward? 